What's up people, it's me, Sami, here again, this side of the camera, and it's been a while since I last time talked to you guys. I'm glad that I can now tell my thoughts to you, and I really appreciate that you're watching, because if you are seeing this, you are watching the video, and that's good. Thumbs up, thank you for supporting me. Uh, I really hope that you watched the, the Australia recap video that I posted uh, a week ago. If not, the link down below in the description to watch that out and get some travel inspiration to Australia. G great success! Yes. So now we can dig into the topic that I'm going to discuss today about. And as you can see in the title of the video, it's going to be about health. And oh damn, my hair looks bad, by the way. Okay, now it's much better. I probably should have watched a mirror more often than once a month. So, about health. What is health? Health is something that we really should appreciate, but sometimes we don't just think that enough to appreciate it. I can say that I've been a very active person the whole of my life. I've been skating. I've been really into fitness. And here you can see me doing some workout um, with the barrels. It weighs roughly 60 kilos, I think. It's uh, 453 pounds for you US viewers. And that truck tire is somewhere 2080 pounds, so 483 kilos, I reckon. And it's not just skateboarding and uh, fitness, I like to move around. sitting on a couch, watching TV, whatever, when you look all of that in the point of view of health, does that really make a sense? Because, to be honest, we are human beings, we are made to move, our bodies are made to move, they are made to feel physical stress, and if we don't use our bodies, they are not working properly. At least for me, I can relate to that, I can say that I feel bad, if I don't move around, if I just lay down on the couch every day, I start to feel bad. And now you're probably thinking, yeah, yeah, not everybody likes going around skateboarding or jumping around, doing backflips or whatever. No, you don't need to. Small things are usually the best things. At least, go for a walk. at this. I just love winter when it, it really is a winter and being outside in this kind of weather it's just so good, it makes you feel so much better and when you really think about it, rather than after work going to... it's a loud truck... Rather than after work going to the couch, lay, playing computer, whatever, 
change up things a bit, go for a walk, see how it makes you feel, how it makes you think about things and I bet that you feel much more energized after walking compared to laying on a couch two hours and after you've done the walk you feel energized, you get so much better sleep and the next day you wake up much brighter and happier person and everything is just rainbows and my little ponies. We are here in this planet only once, so why don't you try to make most of your time and be healthy as possible? That's a cool trick. Snow, but I'm not trying to judge you guys in here. I'm just telling what I personally really feel. I mean, some people are luckier than some other people, that's truth. There is luck being health and being fit, but there is a huge impact what you do by yourself. How are the people? And what's kind of sad is that it's only when something bad happens to people, then they tend to start to realize that hey, health is wealth. It's important to be health, to be able to do things what you really love. But sometimes it's not because of you that you realize that. I personally, I've been really into fitness like I said earlier. I like to move around, I'm an active person. But I've had some minor and also major issues with my health and because some of those and I have a 5 centimeter scar in my back but those things have changed my thinking about health in general completely different and now to be healthy to be able to move to be able to even walk is probably the, one of the biggest things in my life but I don't want to discourage you, I don't want to charge you that you are doing wrong, you're not healthy, no, it's not that. I want to encourage you, I want to encourage you people to move, go, at least go for a walk. That makes a huge difference in your um, well-being. And being health is not just being able to be uh, in good physical shape, it's more than that. It consists food, it consists other people. It consists of food, it consists of other people, it consists of relationships. Those all things are in the word healthy. So this is just something that I wanted to share with you guys and I, I hope that you got something from this. Being healthy is not so self-evident nowadays. I'd say you have to do a bit of work that you feel that. And in my opinion, being able to do the things that you really like is really valuable and important thing. So being health is... You just can't replace that with anything. But anyways, I hope that you liked this video. Hit the like button, hit the thumbs up, hit the subscribe button. I really appreciate that and leave your comments, I'd like to hear what people think, what is health and how they reach their healthy state of well-being. So thank you all and I, I think I continue walking around still a bit in this lovely winter weather in beautiful city of Helsinki, Finland. Thank you and go outdoors, be healthy, be happy.